the release we've all been waiting for, Iceland's entry for this year's Eurovision, has been released yesterday and I haven't watched it yet, so let's react! Hey, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gavin and I am a music student at the University of Amsterdam for those who don't know me. And today I'm really excited because I'm gonna be reacting to the Icelandic entry for Eurovision 2021. They're sending Dali Freyr again uh, with his Gagnamani. As you might know, they had a pretty long road to Eurovision. In 2017, they participated in Iceland's national selection, Song for Kepnin, with the song Vame Fa or Is This Love, in which they ended up in second place. <laughs> I actually thought they should have won that year, but luckily they returned to Song for Captain in 2020 with the song Think About Things. What do you think about things? Believe it. I will always be there so you can tell me anything and I'll listen. And this time they actually won the national selection, which meant they uh, were able to represent Iceland in the Eurovision Song Contest 2020 in which they were actually the favorite to win it all that year before the contest got cancelled and just like many other artists from last year they have been invited back to the contest so their new song is called 10 years and it's actually about his wife with whom he's been together for 10 years now so that explains the title of the song and what I've read online it's a pretty similar vibe to last year so the expectations are really high let's see if they can fulfill them oh and before I press play on the video I want to remind you to subscribe if you haven't already it's really fun here on my channel subscribing is free and it helps me out a lot so thank you in advance and then without any further ado let's click play on Iceland's entry Oh wow, with the string section? That sounds beautiful. But I'm really interested in where the song is gonna take me. <laughs> hey, daddy! This is already so groovy. <laughs> okay. This actually sounds more mellow than their song from last year, if you know what I mean. And his stem goes so low. <laughs> There's the funky dance again. All right. They are holding on to that formula that worked for them. And I mean, I don't blame them. Oh, you can't remember the last time I was bored? That's really cute. Yeah, I don't understand these lyrics, but uh, rhythm is cool. <laughs> Come on with the drum solo! I love that they're playing with the fact that you can have live instruments on stage. So just they just invent imaginary ones. That's so fun. And there's a children's choir out of nowhere. This is so random. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they can then do this on the Eurovision stage, but... It's so weird again, but it sounds so good. I love the funk. Wait, what is it? Is it already over? I This felt like 
one minute, maybe two, but not three minutes. That went by really, really fast. And I mean, that's always a good thing, right? So if you couldn't tell from my reaction, I really enjoyed their entry this year. It's really funky again really groovy i love the dance i love them they're so fun for now i am not getting the same winner vibes as i got from them last year but maybe the song needs to grow on me before i get them but it's not like an instant yes this is gonna win the eurovision song contest 2021 it's not that but um there's no doubt this will make the final there's no doubt this will make the top 10 and daddy and his gaknamani will slay um by the way icelandic people and Am I pronouncing their name right? Dadi and Gaknamani? Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments down below. And also let me know what you think of the song, because my opinion isn't the only one. And I always love reading what you think. Do you think it's better than last year? Do you think it's worse than last year? Do you think this has potential to win the whole thing? Or do you think this is gonna stay in the semis maybe? Let me know and we'll have a nice conversation about it. And then for now, the only thing left for me to say is wish you a very nice rest of your day. And I hope I'll see you in the next video. Bye.